Okay, here's something interesting that I think will uh, come in handy for me. So I try to be very careful of how much sugar I eat and I try to really minimize it. What this here is, is it's called a Digital Bricks Refractor. And this is from the brand Liniza, which is L-N-I-C-E-Z. So L-N-I-C-E-Z Instruments, it's their Digital Bricks Refractor. And what this does, it allows you to test basically the amount of sugar that is in um, liquids, uh, you know, or liquid type uh, food products. So, you know, jellies it can use as well, that kind of stuff. So jellies, juices, different things like that. And it'll tell you the refractive index of the sugar contact of that watery solution. So it's just a quick way of analyzing sugar content. So for me, it's by choice, but there's certainly some people out there who really, you know, can't have sugar, and that's where something like this would really come in handy. So let's check it out, right? It's going to come with a little cloth, and that's because this area where you drip the liquid, you are going to need to, you know, clean off, and you want to keep that dry, because that's where it's actually going to do the measurement, is right there. And then it does come with a little dropper as well. So this runs on batteries, on two AA batteries. So to insert batteries, you're just gonna push that, there's a little button right here, okay? You're gonna push this button down and then slide this forward. And that's gonna open up the little battery door and we can insert the batteries there in a moment. So you've got some nice directions here that you're probably gonna need to refer to, right? It's gonna go ahead and it's gonna tell you primarily in the large part of the screen it's going to give you that refractive index of how much sugar is in the watery substance that you're measuring so and you can do hot or cold um, watery substances okay so let's go ahead and put this on all right so the battery is clicked in and we're ready to go so we can power that up. All right, so it powers up. You can see that there. Bricks, right? And then it's got your uh, ambient temperature and then press measure to measure and then you can zero it out again. Right, so some of the tips it talks about here is really you're just gonna go ahead and drop the solution in here for 20 seconds after 20 seconds, push the measure, okay? Because the instrument is kind of uh, calibrating due to the ambient temperature and the temperature of the liquid. And so it'll take 20 seconds when you uh, need to do that. So make sure that you, you wait before you do that. And then go ahead and just push measure and it's gonna give you your reading, right? So pretty quick and easy. And I'm definitely gonna do a video here I'll attach where we actually do test some different types of um, sugary substances to see how much sugar's in there. Otherwise, when it talks about cleaning, you know, basically um, you can wipe it down. It says, just says clean it with either, you know, alcohol or soapy water and then just dry it off really good. Uh, very easy to use because really you've only got three buttons, a power button, a measure button, and a zero button. And those are all you're going to really need to look at again. Okay, so pretty straightforward device. I think it'll be interesting to see how many th how much sugar is in different things that you don't even think about. So we'll do some measurements, and I'll show you this in action. So again, it's a digital refractor, a Brix digital refractor, and the brand is L N I C E Z Instruments, Linase Instruments.